We, as a community, um, our science skills are not up there. Being here, they learn to do things outside the box. They learn that they can actually do things with their children and enjoy it as well. It's been such a blessing to be able to be an outreach to the families that we service. Not only were our families impacted from these workshops, I have also been impacted from these workshops. Although I was the facilitator, I was still learning things and then I was able to take what I've learned and teach it to our parents and the children and I've even learned things from our families. My role with this workshop is I am a facilitator. I am stepping out of my comfort zone. It's really easy for me to talk to kids and play with the kids, but when I have to talk with parents and the adults, it's a little bit harder. So it's definitely impacted me a lot with the, with the families. My role with this workshop is the facilitator. People say they don't believe I have a hard time speaking in front of people, but I do. <laughs> When I first started, I was so nervous, but as I continued to do the workshops, I got better and better and better. So it kind of like brought me out of my shell. We are going to design our bird feeder. Everybody ready? And it was a really good workshop because it was getting our children involved with their parents. I can say the one thing I truly love about the workshop is the hands-on learning. My thing is to hone in on science while she has that interest now and help build up that part of her that's eager to learn. They have gotten so much knowledge about science, about engineering, that they say, wow, I never knew this. So it has built up their confidence in helping their children. It's just showing them that there's fun in learning science, and it's so important. What are natural resources? When I first started going to the Ready to Learn workshops, I was new to the mentor team, and they needed somebody to go out to the television station to go to the Ready to Learn meeting. And I was sitting there with my head down, they said, Tamika, can you go? And I said, sure. I was quiet in the meetings, and as I kept on going to the meetings, I started talking, and it just took off from there. Gravity, and what does the gravity do? I can say I'm proud to say that the parents see me as more of a educational tool. They'll just say, I have a question for you. So I, I feel like they feel like I'm approachable. So I think I can, I can say I, I'm proud of myself for that. Doing these workshops with Detroit Public Television has increased my self-confidence. When people come to me and ask me for my help, it just really makes me feel like I have accomplished something, like I made a connection. I always want to inspire somebody, and I always want to learn something. Powered by a Ready to Learn brand. For more information, go to dptv.org edu.